filming? Yes. What's going on, you guys? Kim be on the camera here. Bridget was no, here. No, we're not doing that. I'm not doing your part of the intro today. I just want to get right into it, Michael. you guys. What? Why? Because I want to get right into the video. Okay? I'm not giving you time to even bother this week. Bridget was here. Right there. 35 weeks. You are 35 weeks pregnant. How do you feel? Awful. You're starting to breathe heavier. You're starting to sound like me. Okay, chill. What does that mean? What are you saying? Like, <laughs> what you why, why is that such a big insult that you sound like me when you're breathing? <laughs> what are you saying that I sound like breathing? Michael. No, no, no. You said <laughs> something. Now I need to hear the words come out of your mouth. Say it. I'm a pig. You're not Say a it. pig. Say it. I am a pig and you Look, don't sometimes sound like... It Sometimes looks like you're what? dying. <laughs> Excuse me? So I'd rather not look no, like... No, 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 what are you going to roll this back for a second? What you, it sounds like I am dying sometimes? Okay, I'm going to need to see, like, an imitation. I need... What, what does it look like? No, no, don't laugh. I need to know. What does dying look like? Tell all right, me. All right. That is not what I look like. <laughs> it is. Am I asleep at the time? No. What am I doing? See, sometimes I think you are, but you're actually not. Huh? Yeah. Okay, don't lie. Not on video. That's not me. That's you. <laughs> it's not. I don't care. I'm not going to talk about it, you guys. Today is Wednesday. If you did not see the last video we uploaded, I finally got my foot, shoved it up my sister's <laughs> and I threw her out of the house. We're not getting goodbye. Nope. Get out of here. I can't. I'm blocked. Oh, no. Go, 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 I'm go. I'm blocked. Go. Oh, my God. Jesus. No, go. Go, oh, go. I'm, blo I'm blocked. We're stuck? No, we didn't do anything. She chose to leave. Yeah, okay. She chose to leave because she knew that I was going to lay down the hammer. Okay, that's what happened. Uh, no, Michael. No, we're not going to talk about We're not doing this. I chose to, like, You were her... terrified and he crapped your pants. Huh? You were scared of your sister. Okay, nobody crapped in or around their pants. Okay, you're making stuff up. Around? That's... That's, okay, let me finish. That's not what I'm oh talking about. Oh my god. About. I'm not talking, okay. Who the f*** on their pants? You, apparently. Okay. No. Ew. Okay, you, please, can we do this? The point is, my sister chose to leave because I chose Bridget's side. You need help. You need therapy. I don't know. I don't know. No! This is bull****! Every time I'm the f***ing family! So the next morning, out of just pure desperation. And humiliation. Desperation, humiliation, embarrassment, whatever you want to call it, Kim came crawling back and she tried to pretend that the entire thing was a prank. Yeah, right. There was absolutely no way that my sister put together a prank that lasted an entire month where she made us believe that her and her husband are getting a divorce and she's losing her mind and nobody believes it. Kim, you're a liar. You're not creative and there's no way that you can outsmart me. I would be able to see right through it. Why are you zooming in? Is that embarrassing? It's a little embarrassing. A little so. fool of myself? Yeah, I have to say it out loud, you know? You, you think that stuff inside. Kim, look. I love you, kind of, but there's no way that you came up with some disgusting, heinous, just repulsive garbage like that. And if you did, shame on you. Maybe your marriage should No, end. no, it should not be over. They need to stay together. That's right, because she'd come back here. Her, like, Kim, you and Kyle are right together. Dude. Yeah, they're wonderful. You guys are Very like, happy. You're like two peas in a very odd. A normal pod. A, a no you guys are like best friends. You go together like peanut butter and jelly. Yeah, and like bread and cheese. Just say peanut butter and jelly. Why do you gotta like... <laughs> now something I actually cut out of the last vlog that you guys never saw is I kept pressing her up about it because you know what? I know she's lying and I'm gonna get into the... I'm gonna find out. Were you really pranking us? Yes, absolutely. Lily, did you know about this? The whole time you knew we were being pranked? Did you know about this too? Yeah. You knew we were being pranked the whole time you didn't tell us? Uh -huh. Do you just not love us? I do love you. Your mom's a liar. Are you aware of that? <laughs> what? You hurt me. You guys want to hear some stories about your mom? Nope. You guys want to? Nope, let's go. 
You want to hear some stuff? Are no. you really pranking us? Yes, of course. I am. It's a prank. Oh, my so God. So you didn't snap? No. Wow, well, then, Bridget, you can't get out of this one. You're right. Well, if you're totally normal and didn't snap, I am really sorry. Oh. No, hold on. That didn't feel genuine to me. It was pretty genuine to me. It's about as genuine as she gets. I feel it, though, and she's pregnant. Yeah. Oh. Well, before you go to the airport, you want to do, like, anything else? Who likes hot dogs? Well, we have a place here called Jack's Cosmic Dogs. Ooh. What time's your flight? Uh, six. Six? Did you just book it this morning? No. If you booked it, like, yesterday, you would have left at, like, 11 in the morning. No. What's going on? Did your mom pay you to lie? I'm going to maintain the fact that I think Kim, your mother... Is actually a liar. Hey! All right, get she's out. lying no, right now. Get out! Get what? out! We're not doing this. Uh, you can't kick me out of my house. Watch me. Bye. Can we get hot dogs? You're still leaving. Yes. Right? Yes. Bye. She's a liar. Definitely. Huh? I am not a goddamn liar. Not to shut off. Seriously, go. Go. Okay. We'll go. <laughs> Come on! What's going on? She like banged on something. What? How far did they go? Lily, bang the wall twice if you need help. No? No, nope, we're good. Seriously? You're gonna try to get my kids afraid of me? So we just got here. That was about a 30, 40 minute drive. You know what that means, right, Kim? When you drive 40 minutes for a hot dog, it's gotta be good. And you don't just get one. We're gonna be feasting for the next three hours on hot dogs. All right, I'm ready for it. We're gonna order a bunch of hot dogs. We're gonna eat them. We're gonna go back. We're gonna order more hot dogs. And the cycle continues and until. Cheese fries. Oh, yeah, of course. And the cycle continues until one of us passes out or I go into a diabetic shock. Okay, my After. Okay. Oh, cover this lens. Copyright. Oh, yeah. That right there is chili, onion, sweet potato mustard, and I guess you got ketchup on I there. I did. Ketchup. Not your favorite. Boy. Ketchup does not belong on a hot dog. Let's yes, just let's just say that right now. Whatever. Let's just get to this. All right. Yeah. Mm. First, we feast. Ketchup does not belong on a hot dog. I don't know. Whose idea? Why do you do that? It's delicious. It adds that little bit of sweetness to it. Do you need the sweetness when you got sweet potato I mustard? I guess not, but I usually don't eat sweet potato mustard, so... I'm telling you now. Ketchup. No. Alright, here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. That's good, ma'am. You want to try it, Lil? You sure? You want to try it, Lil? It is mad busting. It is mad busting. Are you sure? Can I be honest? Okay. <laughs> You're gonna love this. What? Guys, something that you may not know about me and Kim. We both suffer from the exact same stomach problem. Okay, do I got dumping syndrome? No. I, I get, well, I get diarrhea almost as soon as I eat. <laughs> okay, cut this out. That's just a gallbladder thing. Can we just cut it out and just say Kim? Yeah. Guys, something you don't know about Kim and only Kim. <laughs> Kimberly suffers from the exact same thing that dad and me and Jennifer and mom, the entire family has <laughs> whenever we eat food. Within like 20 minutes, we have got projectile diarrhea ready to explode out. Well, I don't have it. I'm the only one in the family that doesn't actually. <laughs> Unless you eat like fried it's chicken. It totally skipped me for some reason. I don't ever even get that. That's the cool thing about being me. Or but, donuts. But that's, I don't have this disease. <laughs> Okay, don't laugh at me. Or macaroni and cheese. Or anything. Or water. Or anything. That I don't have. Definitely don't, not, you know. I don't, I don't suffer from this. <laughs> oh my god. What are you trying to say? I knew that my sister was going to eat a chili dog. <laughs> pot and roast. she was on that. Pot roast too now, huh? Listen. Kim ate hot dogs. And <laughs> had diarrhea on the plane. So yeah. 
My sister is officially gone. And thank God. Seriously, I mean, thank God. She completely wore out her welcome. She definitely did. That girl does not know boundaries. She don't know boundaries, and guess what? She is never allowed to step foot into my house again. Okay? This is my private domicile. You are not allowed back. Is a domicile a car? I don't know. I never heard of it. It says a domicile is a country that a person treats as their permanent home. I don't... Oh I got it on Breaking Bad, okay? Okay. Look, the point is that Kim was so bad that she's no longer welcome, and we actually FaceTimed with her that night to make sure she was actually back at her house. Absolutely. She ain't welcome here. She's not answering. Hey. Hi, hey, babe. What's up? Are you home? Yeah. Oh, okay. How was the flight? Not good. My stomach was upset from... Them hot dogs, so I had diarrhea really bad. Oh, we're, God. we're recording this. Oh, no. <laughs> bad diarrhea? That's horrible. Oh my God. Oh my God, Cam, that is like, that's upsetting news. It was cosmic, I'll tell you that. <laughs> cosmic diarrhea? Yeah. Oh man, so you're home though. Yeah, I'm home. Okay, can you, let me just, uh. Can we see Kyle? Yeah, is Kyle anywhere near you or any, like another human being that lives in New York? To, I just want to see if Kyle's there. Uh, can you confirm that you guys are good and, uh, like, never breaking up? Is it a prank? Mm -hmm. Was she pranking me for an entire month? <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, we need to know that you both are in Syracuse. Yeah, you're both in Syracuse, New York? Yes. Okay. Okay, that's good. Here, look, here's my, here's my puppy. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, they're, they're home. Here's the question, Kyle. Son of a Why do you want to see us? Why'd you leave so... Okay, bye. Hang it up. Hang it up. I don't care. Okay? She's home. Okay, so she apologized. They're good. They are the picture of happiness. They belong together. Seriously. It's like yeah. a fairy tale. Seriously. For real. It's like, you ever, like, like Cinderella? How, yeah. like, the slipper fits right on? Yeah. That's them. It's like Kyle's the slipper. Kyle's the slipper and Kim's the rubber. <laughs> <laughs> Redo that. It's like Kim is Cinderella and Kyle is the slipper. Uh-huh. They belong together and don't ever need to come back. They're very happy. They're like, I'm jealous. Me too. I want to be like them. I don't care. I don't trust her. Period. I never did. You never- what? I never okay. did. Well, I kind of trusted her before. Oh. <laughs> she wasn't always completely out of her damn mind. Have you not trusted her like my sister? Oh, okay. No, I, I trusted her. I just... Honestly, you may be right, because guys, we went upstairs to clean the room that Stinky's been staying in for the past couple... Well, I can't call her that. Guys, um, we went... Up, look, I'm really mad at her. She ruined my life for an entire month. Guys. Look, it was it was weird, okay? Look, we it went upstairs to clean the room that my sister has been staying in for the past month, and we found something that she's been hiding. You have got to calm down, dude. You're losing it. Michael, I'm not losing anything. You're losing your mind, Bridget. I get it was like a bad visit, okay? What the heck is that? Was that Dad's? Yeah, I. It was in the pillowcase. What? Mia, don't touch anything. That's weird. That's weird. You didn't put that there? No. I've been looking for this thing. Yeah, I haven't seen it in so long. Mia, baby, don't touch anything, okay? I don't know what any of the stuff is. What the okay. hell? That is... Should we look for more stuff? Clearly. Was she gonna freaking hit us with that? Yeah. Kim wants to bash my head in with Angry Grandpa's hammer. What is wrong with you, Kim? What were you planning? Were you just sleeping on a hammer? Or like, what was the deal here? Did you want to steal it? I, I don't understand. How did you forget a hammer inside one of the pillows that you were sleeping in? Guys, that's not all we found either. Jesus. Anything? No, not really. Maybe I left it there. Maybe I left like a hammer in the pillowcase. Michael, when have you ever slept in this bed? I don't know, and when she have noticed it? Was, did she put a hammer in the pillow? Okay, okay. Fake, Kim, pranking us. You were saying, were you going to bash my head in when I was asleep? Oh my god. She's not even welcome back to family functions. What's this? What? 
What? Okay. That's, huh? That's a little weird. Huh? What is that? That's clearly a bug! What? That's not a she bug? She bugged our house, dude! That's an electronic! That's a listening device! I don't know what it's connecting to. It's just sitting there like this. Look! Michael, that does not look like a damn bug. That'll look like a listening device to you? Well, yeah, it looks like that. that. That's what a bug is! Do you think that's what a roach? Yes! You a bug! And an electronic listening device. <laughs> Okay, Mia is freaking out a lot more than we are. How do you not know what a bug is? When they say your house is bugged? I thought you had to call like pest control. Oh my god, dude, you're stupid! Okay, you're Michael. You're stupid! You know what? Our house has a listening device in it, dude. <laughs> that, what's funny about that? I don't believe it. You obviously put that there. If I did, it was when we moved in and I completely forgot about it. Big sure she's not trying to... Take my tail as a beetle to bar. Seriously. This thing is very valuable, Bridget. Huh? What is that? What? Uh, nothing. What? Nothing. Michael, show me. You're always like trying to start crap. It's nothing. Me? Yeah. Mia Annie Pratt? Yeah, that's Kim's middle name. Ann. What is she trying to do, Michael? I don't know, Bridget. Mia Ann Pratt? Call the cops. This is creepy. I'm not kidding. I don't want What is going on with your bloodline? This is like, okay, you got messed up bloodline too, Bridget, okay? Your dad is messed up. You know it. His entire side of the family are crackheads and meth addicts. I don't care. Okay. Seriously. I don't even consider them my, my family, so. That's, this is like, you ever seen the Hand of Ross Cradle? No. Family hires a babysitter to come live in their house. And the babysitter starts to think that she is the kid's mom. <gasps> She's uh -uh. the hand that rocks the cradle. Maybe that's just... <sighs> that is her! I don't... I don't know. This is weird. This is very weird. Okay, I don't want to... Do we use this? I don't know. She's kind of crazy, dude. She needs new medication. This one ain't working for her. This ain't funny. This stuff is not funny, dude. Like, I'm actually, like... I don't want to use any of this, like seriously. She's not a lot back. So she's planting listening devices around the house. She's hiding weapons to kill us in our sleep and she's trying to rename our daughter so that she can adopt her. Am I getting all this right? Yes. And she honestly expects us to believe that this entire thing was a prank. That being a prank means that Kimberly purposely Ruined a perfectly good vacation to act like a complete psychopath for nearly an entire month. We could have gone places. We could have done things. We could have went to the aquarium, the zoo. We could have went out to Hall's Chop House. We could have had a lot of fun. I know. But we didn't because we didn't like where you were acting. We didn't like how you were running things. We didn't like how you were scaring us in our sleep. You ruined a completely good vacation if you were pranking us. But come on, Kim. We both know that it wasn't a prank. Guys, here's what really happened. Kimberly and the girls and Kyle, they come to South Carolina without our permission and decide to have a family vacation in our house. Now, if you ask me, I think Kyle thought that they had permission. The girls probably thought the same thing. <laughs> Kim's just a liar. She probably told them, yeah, I talked to them. Yeah, they're totally cool with it. We had no clue <laughs> they gave that this, me this woman. Key. Yeah, that's probably what it is. She like, why would I not have permission if I have a key to the house and their vehicle? Oh my god. Guys, we took our car keys with us to New York. Yeah. She was driving around our vehicles. Now while they're here, Kim and Kyle clearly got into some kind of altercation. They were arguing, maybe it was about steak. Whatever happened. He chooses to leave because the only way to escape Kim's BS is to leave state. Otherwise, <laughs> she's going to follow you around the house. She's going to provoke you. She's going to poke and prod until you snap and it's not going to look good. So we chose to leave state. 
That's when Kim decided she was divorcing Kyle because she was too embarrassed to admit that she made a mistake. So Kyle goes home, they're bickering back and forth. He can't take her BS anymore. And Kim is slowly unraveling and taking it out on us. Oh my God, yes. Am I like, this is like what happened. That's this, what happened. This is exactly what happened. And that is when Kimberly finally snapped. She threatened to kill us with a baseball bat. She realized that she completely torched the bridge and she could never come back to our house, which meant she had to crawl back to hers. She knew she fucked up and she came crawling back to Kyle to apologize. And that's when we recorded this. Cam? You wanna talk? Huh? Oh my god. Me? Kim? Oh my god. Alright, dude. Come on, bro. What did you do? The f if I know, I took your side. Should have never took your side, bro. What do you mean? You know what Vin Diesel said, it's all about family. It's not me that she hates, it's Kyle. Oh my God. And she hates crawling back and apologizing to him because he was right all along. Am I onto something? Yes. Am I good or am I good? You're too good. It's I'm dangerous good to be that this. good. Thank you so much. I'm finally getting the acknowledgement I deserve. Guys, that's gonna be it for today. I'm getting out of here. I just wanted to clear the air about what's going on with my sister. She is a complete liar or deranged or I don't know. I don't trust her. All of the above. All of the above and she is not welcome back. And if she did prank us, good job. It was a good prank, but I don't buy it. I know. And honestly, I think you should tell her like the wrong due date. Honestly, she wants to come back when the baby's born. I think she should tell her like September 8th. I, I did tell her. Uh, you did? Yeah. Okay, that's good. So she's not coming back for the birth? No. That's good. Now we just gotta look out for dung. Oh, God. She's probably gonna be there dressed up like a doctor again. Oh, my God. How do we miss that? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's Jason Bourne. Guys, I'm getting out of here. Thanks for watching. Kim, I don't believe a word you say, and I don't trust you anymore. Okay, I'm getting it. I'm honestly not as angry as I seem. I'm just getting it off my chest. I know. I mean, you were messed with for like a month. We for both were. For an entire month, she like, wore out her welcome. Yeah. I used to love my sister. Now I don't. <laughs> Anna, it's like, I'm pissed. Okay. And then she pranked us. Good on you. I don't like admitting that I was pranked. Yeah. It was like, I wanted to come home and enjoy my Speaking life. Speaking of, you are due next month. I think that we should cancel prank day. 